The Mix It Up bot was initially created for full integration for Mixer streamers only. Well, with Mixer now shut down, the developers have been working really hard to integrate Mix It Up bot with other platforms like Twitch and Facebook Gaming. Welcome back to the Stream Loots YouTube channel where we talk about everything streaming and stream loots. My name is Preacher, and in today's video, I'm going to give you a quick guide on how to set up Mix It Up bot with Stream Loots. Today, I'll show you how to download and install the Mix It Up bot as well as connecting the bot with Stream Loots. And then I'll give you some basic chat commands that can be really useful for your chat to see when people purchase chests and when they play cards from your collections. With that being said, let's get into it. So the first thing that we need to do is download the Mix It Up bot. And in order to do that, we'll go to mixitupapp.com. Now, when you go to the website, you're going to notice that they still have a lot of language geared towards Mixer streamers, but they are currently updating a lot of this and working to integrate it fully with other platforms, as I said before. If you want a little bit more information about that, you can click this link here. It gives a, a timeline of how they're integrating and when they're integrating everything fully for each platform. Now, to download Mix It Up, we're going to click download here and then click the download installer here. Once you do that, it'll start downloading to your computer and you can begin opening up the application to set it up. Once you have the application installed, simply open it up. And if this is your first time logging in to Mix It Up, you're going to see this prompt and it's going to give you some information about the future of Mix It Up and that they're working on some updates for the bot. For me, for the sake of this video, we can hit skip. And then you're going to need to connect your account with whatever platform account you're using. So for me, that's my Twitch account. And I'm going to click it there and log in. Now, I've already connected my credentials, so I don't have to do that here. But you may have to do that if this is your first time logging in to mix it up. Once we've logged in, we're going to be landing on their chat section of the bot. And we need to go to the menu here in order to connect this with our Streamlutes account. So we're going to go down to services. And this is going to give us a list of integrations that mix it up allows. We're going to go down to Streamlutes. And then there's going to be a short explanation of how to connect this with your Streamlutes account. We need to grab the Streamlutes alerts overlay URL from our creator dashboard on Streamlutes. So we're going to go there now. And from our creator dashboard, we're going to go down to alerts and goals and then click go to alerts. And then you're going to copy and paste your URL here. Simply click copy. Go back to mix it up and then paste it here and click login. Once you've done that, your Streamlutes account is now connected with the Mix It Up bot. Now that we've connected our Streamlutes account with Mix It Up, we can now begin to use special identifiers related to Streamlutes when we create commands for our chat. For a list of all of the identifiers that work with Mix It Up bot, we'll leave a link in the description below so you can check them out for yourself. And we'll show a few of them here in this video as we go through some of the commands now. Now, the first command that we're going to create is going to be one that promotes our Streamlutes collections for our viewers. That's going to run in the chat and give them a direct link to our Streamlutes page where they can check out all of the collections that we have. In order to do this, we're going to go back to the menu at the top left. We're going to click on commands. And then we're going to click on the custom commands. Mine's already selected here. Click new command, then basic chat command, and then begin filling out the fields here. This is going to be who is allowed to run the command. This is going to be the cooldown. We'll set it for 60 seconds for that command. And then the trigger that we want to uh, have in the chat in order to run the message that we want. So for this, we'll type in stream loots, and then a chat message that's going to run when this is typed in the chat. So something to the effect of check out my newest Streamlutes collection. It's the best way to support the stream while creating hilarious moments. And then the link to your Streamlutes collections. Once you've done that, click save. And then this command will now be added to your list of commands in Mix It Up. If we want to test this command, we can go back to the chat, the live chat here. Go down to the chat message and type in our command name, which is Streamlutes. And then it'll run the chat message that we have linked to that command. It's that simple. Now that we have a manually triggered promo command for Streamlutes, we can also set up an automatic command that'll run automatically every uh, 10 minutes, let's say. Um, and we can set that time limit however we'd like. In order to do this, we're going to go to the timers in the menu. 
and you can see that the intervals are already set right here and we're going to click on new command we'll do basic chat command and this is going to be very similar to what we did before so for this one we're going to type in exclamation point sl and we'll do a similar chat message as what we had before and then simply click save so now what this is going to do is this is going to run that command every 10 minutes without us having to trigger it at all the next thing that we're going to look at with stream loots and mix it up is mix it ups events and events are essentially alerts that run in the chat when your viewers either purchase stream loots or play a card things like that that give uh, recognition to those who are supporting you through your stream loots within mix it ups events you can have three different chat commands that run and are triggered when somebody either redeems a stream loots card purchases a stream loots chest or gifts a stream loots chest to another viewer now i've already set these up and we can check out some of the commands that i have and these can be customized to your liking when somebody redeems a card uh, from my stream loots this is the message that's going to pop up now as i said before there are special identifiers that will actually be replaced by something else what i mean by that is for example in this command this identifier which is the dollar sign stream loots card name is actually going to be replaced by the name of the card that's played and it's not going to actually show this now there's a few different stream loots identifiers that we'll leave a link for in the description below that you can check out so in this command it's going to show the card name has been played by the person who played it and it's going to show the message that might be attached to that particular card if you have messages attached to your stream loots cards once you have this message set the way that you want it you can click save for the packs purchased event i have the chat command that involves two different identifiers this is going to be the username of the person who purchased the chests and then this identifier which is going to be replaced by how many chests they purchased so the command would read something like so and so just purchased 10 stream loots chests let's go and lastly for the packs gifted this command simply shows the person who's gifting the chest's name just gifted some stream loots chests if you want to test any of these commands simply push the play button here to test it you can go back to your chat log and you'll see that the test has been run in your chat now this would be replaced in real time in the event that any of your viewers purchase stream loots from you gift stream loots to another user or if they play a card and that's really it for this quick guide to setting up stream loots with the mix it up bot we know that this bot in particular has way more functionality than what we covered in this video so please let us know in the comment section below if there's anything else with this bot that you'd like us to cover we do plan on doing a tutorial video of this bot in the future so please be on the lookout for that if this video helped you in any way please let us know by giving us a thumbs up and if you have any other questions please leave them in the comment section below thanks again for watching this video and as always to stay up to date with all things streaming and stream loots make sure to click that subscribe button so you don't miss out on the future videos that we have coming out thanks again and we'll see you guys in the next video